Hi guys, how's it going? Welcome back to the den. Hey, another Wednesday, come on, another shave. And we've got a good one lined up for you today. Thanks to Steve D and thanks to you on that on that last video. You all went on and thanked him for the wonderful stuff. Cheers guys, you guys really are the best. Um, as you've seen today, I'll give you a brief run around. This is what Steve sent me. That's the sort we're going to be using. He sent me those blades as well, amongst others. And they're the blades we're going to be using. So uh, we'll have a look at this. Fines American Blend 21st Century. There you go. That's it. Yeah, unmistakably fines. Unmistakably fines. But we're going to be having a soap off. So we're going to be using this. Now, this does actually say in the box, made in Italy. And the ingredient list, although there's some that are the same, uh, I would say for me, 60, maybe 70% of the ingredients read differently. Now, I don't know if that's the same thing, they just give a different name. Like some people call tallow tallowate, some people call it stereot tallowate, uh, or, or whatever. Do you know what I mean? It's all tallow, isn't it? So I don't know that, but reading one side by side, I was going to get a picture and put them up and insert them now. PC's dead. Can't do it. I'm doing all of this off of my phone, guys. So please stick with me. The ingredients look about 60% different. And keep that number in mind. It's about 60% different. That's going to come into play later. Thank you very much, Steve. I've been wanting to try this. Okay. I'm not saying anything just yet. We're going to be comparing that to this. A salt bowl. Whee! No, it's not a salt bowl. This. I've had this sat in there, guys. Oh, years, years. I bought the puck in Pastor's Pharmacy, um, and then I went back a year or so later. Look at that lot. And I bought the ball. See that? I bought the ball in Pastor's Pharmacy. And this is where it gets interesting. That's been sat in there like that, just in that box, at least five years. At least five years and this smells stronger and different to this one if you've got them both you'll be able to back me up in the comments you can tell it's the same scent but that's much stronger and smells much more refined to me it really does that 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 this one, I, I'm sorry, Steve, I, I really don't want to seem ungrateful. I'm not ungrateful. I really am very grateful. But um, I can't say this without something <laughs> ungrateful. Can I? This is, you would smell this and you would think, was that fine? Smell this and you'd go, oh, that's fine, American blend. It's unbelievable. And yet I don't know how old that is, but that's been, look, look, it's been used. It was a big put, that guy's. The original puck and it's been used repeatedly and still it smells strong i'll put the scent strength on that at about 6.5 i'll put the scent strength on that at about 4.5 so although they're the same that one uh, um, is stronger so we'll see what they're like in the lava and i'm not denigrating i'm not denigrating the 21st century one you know production values move um covid costs business do you know what I mean? Um, they have to do it, they have to do it, and so on. Um, I know this was made at a factory in Italy. That's still made at a factory in Italy. So I don't know. But scent strength, this is this is um this just blows that one out of the water. Okay. We're gonna be splashing up with this. <laughs> Fine. American blend for oh. Can you see that? It says pastors. Pharmacy, that's because of. <laughs> oh my word, and we're going to be bamming up, bamming up with this. Christopher Thompson sent me that. But the last one that I had of this, I got. I got from Pastor's Pharmacy, or oh, you couldn't make them. Do you know what? People have actually said, John, have you really actually been to Pastor's Pharmacy? Some have cast aspersions. I mean, come on, guys. Like, I would tell a porcupine, like, I would tell an El Puercos. It's not happening. So, what I've decided to do to that end, when this shaves over, I'm going to Pastor's. So, I will see you for the Saturday morning shave. And we'll have a chat. We'll see if we can see Leon 
We'll go walk around past those. I'll get what footage I can. They may be shut when I get there, but I will get some and we'll put it in on the Saturday shave. So tune in Saturday for John Shaves 101 from Pastor's Pharmacy. Okay, there you go. Razor we're going to be using. Fines. What's it called? Dad Brain. It's the Fines razor. Not the new one, the older one. And what we're gonna do. Come on, let's get this in. Do you know guys, do you remember I cut the, the, my thumb off and, and like my arm was hanging off and everything? Do you know what? If you're working, if you're out there and you watch these videos and you work in the medical field, why, why would you watch these videos and you work in the medical field? Check that out. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but do you know what, guys? It's still sore and I still can't use the tip of my thumb to press anything up with. Unbelievable. You wouldn't have thought that. But anyway, thank you, Steve. Wow. These, check on. Oh, I was going to say they're wrapped in really thick paper, but there's two of them. So it's just a really thick, a really thick person. Uh, uh, high tech steel blade. Let's have a look. Treat Corporation Limited, Pakistan. Let's get these out of here. And there it goes. It's a nice looking blade. That's what people say to me. Why do you say a nice looking blade? That's what well, some of them do look shocking, you know, when you get them out. There you go. There you go. Oh my word. I'm looking forward to this. Should you tell I had a haircut? I said, nice and short, please. It's not actually. Uh, I didn't actually have it this. My barber was short. I had to go somewhere else. Um, so there you go. Brushes. As far as I can, I'm knocking down the variables. So the same brushes, we've got two of them low. We've got two of them. Can you see them there? Simpsons T3. And we're going to put them in the new official John Shave Super Suck. So they can both fit in there. Do you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to lather up one side of my face and then lather up the other side of the face. So you can get a visual look at what the lathers look like. Um, I'll just try and keep everything oh, as close as I can. Here you go. 21st century, what should we do? With the 21st century on the left and the Fines American on the right, because I'm left-handed. So I'll get I'll naturally get a better one and a better on this side. So I'll use that on here uh, to give it every, every kind of advantage. And we'll use this. Let's see if we can time it. What we've got, should we say? No, it's not really going to work to me. I was going to say, should we time it? There you go. We'll get a load on there. We'll put that there. I was going to time how long it'd take to load, but one's much, much softer than the other, so it probably wouldn't work. Here you go. Let's have a... Have a now, do you know, somebody, somebody is going to say, oh, do you know, you did this one longer, you did that one longer, and you didn't have an even line right down your face. You didn't mask it off with masking tape and sweat. So if you're thinking of commenting like that, yeah, don't. Shut down your way out. There you go. So that's that. Play tonight somewhere. Okay. <sighs> Had a shower. Sweating like a bull again. Oh my word. It's raining out there and hotter than most summer's days. Here we go. This is the 21st century. Let's see. Hmm. Right, do you know what? The one thing it shares in common with that fine American blend is that you can smell it as you're bringing it. It's starting to fill the whole bathroom now. And yeah, yeah. And it feels, yeah, it's on me. Now, now we're laddering it, that's unmistakable. Um, and I've got to be honest with you guys, just making sure I've not got the brushes. My memory's shocking. Um, check this out. Hey, you can't argue with that, can you? Hey, we'll put that, could take more water. Look at this, guys. Wow. Well, I'll tell you what.
There's absolutely nothing wrong with that lather whatsoever at all. Um, yeah. Yeah, wow. I'm impressed with that. Come on, let's do a slickness test. Wow, oh, yeah. Right. It's not as slick as the other, I can remember the other finds, but here we go. Have I got them? Mm, yeah, once again. Now, it may be, my light in my bathroom is on, it's up there. The bathroom's what? Bathroom's about six feet wide and it's about two feet away from the wall. It's right there. So there may be a shadow, but on the camera and in the mirror that you're sitting on, this ladder looks a slightly darker colour. But when I'm watching the playback, no. Mm. Do you know what guys? In lather form. In lather form there isn't a great deal of difference. There isn't a great deal of difference between them at all. Okay. Here we go. That blade's smooth. That blade is smooth. Now I've got treat blades in there, but and I may even have maybe screaming at John you've got that one, but do you know what? I don't know. I've used some treat blades in the past, but that one's that's a smooth blade. Do you know what guys? Probably won't know by feel. Until the very end of the shave, you know, until it's the bed, till we get down, till we get down to the bare skin. But they both feel the same to me. When lathered, they both feel like a rich, dense, creamy lather, but Yeah, yeah. Do you know what? There isn't much between them. Now I'm a big fan of that, I'll show you. No, there isn't there isn't much between them at all. Whew. Okay, here we go. Oh, so please let me know. If you've used the 21st century, hmm? please let me know what you thought of it. Now, here's the test. See, once again, the lather looks different to me. But that could well be my phone. My phone is shocking. Absolutely shocking. The screen's gone and it's screen bleed and everything. But that's what I'm saying. Even in the mirror. Even in the mirror behind it looks a slightly different colour. Um, so we're two passes in now. What do you reckon? Can you see a difference? I mean, we're not scientists, are we guys? It's just wet shaming, but if I can give you guys uh, 
an idea and then <laughs> as a YouTube <laughs> wet shaver we are always looking for something different aren't we to try and do with a channel there's only I, do, I said that to my wife and she thought it was hilarious do you know what I mean what you're going to shave standing on your head and although it was funny it did actually prove a valid point there is only so much you can do when you're having a shave isn't there so you know next time you see Paul Humphreys or Paul Fox or JC Shaves or Mark Zaredi or uh, Jim Will Shave or all those guys next time you see any of those guys trying something different uh, just spare a thought for them let you know hats off to them because it is difficult to come in here and uh, find something you know that keeps people entertained that does smell really nice you know lathered guys it really really does no do you know once lathered in the puck it's different but once lathered there's not a lot between these two scent well, well not no I, I yeah i would go so far as to say there isn't there isn't really a noticeable difference scent wise once lathered so here we go I'm being a little bit cautious because I don't know if you can see it, my glasses are actually steaming up. I do not like having a shower before I film. For this reason and various other reasons. But yeah. So let me know what your shave of the day is. And like I said, let me know. Comment below and let us know what you, what you think. You can have that one, Mark. Mark's already, see? I bet you won't get him in his next shape going, hey, bye, lads. <laughs> oh, my word. Right. Yeah, you know. No, feels exactly the same. Okay, lather mittens. What do you reckon? Can't argue with that, can you? Can't argue with that. Lather mittens. What do you reckon? Yeah, this, it looks a bit shinier, this one. Um, it does. Let me just see. On my hand, no. No, there isn't. I can't see any difference in colour. Um, verdict. Oh, do you know, I've just washed it all off, so there's nothing left for lather mittens now. No lather mittens. Um... Verdict, what would you say? Um, I would say in the raw state, this is, this is just me personally, if you were judging them just in their raw state, uh, you would think the old version is better. But once lathered and in practical use terms, the scent's more or less stayed the same. And they both did an absolutely exceptional job, although the lather on the old stuff did seem a little bit, a slightly different, a little bit, it might be the shadow on this side of the bathroom, it looks slightly darker, slightly, we're talking millionths of a, a millisecond, you know what I mean, millimetre, um, slightly darker, slightly shinier, slightly creamy, slightly denser, but they both performed and smelled exactly the same, guys. 
So, verdict. Would I buy that? Yeah, yeah would I, surely? I would. I would. I would buy it. Um, yeah. Yeah, I was pretty much the same, actually. I would, I would yeah. Here we go. Well, have I told you I got that from Pastor? <laughs> Remember, tune in Saturday. Not be sat at home now saying he's not going to Pastor's. He's, yeah, I'm going to Pastor's on Saturday, guys. To silence the naysayers. There you go. Yep. Mm. Yep, that razor did good. Absolutely wonderful. See? See, if my dad was alive now, he'd, he'd have me in a headlock going, he's here, officer, he's here. Oh, my word. Lovely bomb. So there you go. Lovely shave. Lovely balm. Lovely gesture from a lovely man. Thank you, Steve. Uh, and that's good stuff. That's, that's good stuff. I would buy it. I'm not telling yous out there to buy it. I'm just saying when I run out of that, and I'm eventually going to run out of that fine American blend, um, yeah, I'll buy it. I'll buy it. I was as upset as anybody when they stopped making the hard pucks and the different recipe and so on. Uh, that's allayed my fears. It's good stuff. It's good. I'm trying to adjust my glasses and I haven't even got them on. Look after yourselves, guys. Look after each other. Um, that was... I never did it, did I? Well, what? Two police cars gone that way now, so... Do you know what I mean? We live in a really quiet village. Somebody's probably tripped up over a cat and it's caused outrage. Look after yourselves and I will see you on Saturday. Let's see, I've not taken any shaving gear with me. So I will shave. <laughs> see, I don't want to buy something from Pasteur's and then open it. I want, to, I want to do a haul video when I come back. So it may just be a cartridge razor, you know, and some Gillette for me. But we'll have fun and I'll get some footage of Pasteur's for you now. The last half a dozen times I've been to Pasteur's, I have had a chat to Leon. Uh, now I've got a YouTube channel and I'm holding a camera. It won't be there, will it? But if I can get a chat with Leon, I will do. Look after yourselves. I'll see you Saturday, guys. Bye.